What is up YouTube Luca here with another PvP build. I'm on my stand blade with a bow bow setup back bar. I'm using the master's bow which gives over 300 weapon and spell damage if we use poison arrow. I'm with venom arrow for major brutality instead of poison injection. Then the front bar set a swamp raider. What else? A must have if you use lethal arrow as spammable. Almost 600 weapon damage to your poison disease damage abilities. Then a smithic item talk for sustain. One magma. And the other 5 set piece bonus is Red Eagle's Fury. It gives slightly more weapon spell damage than New Moon. With the same cost increase. But it only buffs the weapon skill abilities. Which is not a problem this build. Because I use Venom Arrow, Weapon Skill Ability, Lethal Arrow, Magnum Shot, and Toxic Barrage. The only skill that gets not buffed is Relentless Focus, and of course our healing abilities like Vigor. For Impen, and 3 Well Fitted. Depends on your place, so you can also put more Well Fitted here or more Impen. Full prismatic glyphs for extra magica, which we need for cloak. Then full infused weapon damage. We have already enough sustain with talk. We can go full weapon damage. Then swamp raider spore and sharpened with the disease damage glyph for minor defile. And backed by the master spore in defending with the escapist poisons. Skills Magnum shot or CC. Camouflage Hunter for Minor Berserk and Major Savagery. Lethal Arrow, our main spammable. Relentless Focus. Shadow Disguise. And Toxic Barrage. Look at the tooltip by the way, it's unbuffed. Back by Venom Arrow, like I said before, for Major Brutality. We don't have Rally without a 2 age, So I can just use the Tricep Potions instead of the Brutality Potions with Venom Arrow. Elude for Mage Evasion and Mage Expedition. Resolving Vigor over here. Leeching Strikes for Sustain and Pursing Mark for Mage Breach 6k, almost 6k penetration. And you can also put it on Night Blade so they can't stealth away. And it's for free, costs nothing. As Defensive Ultimate Soul Siphon, better option would be probably uh, Temporal Guard Obsidic Ultimate. But as you can see, I don't have it on level 10. Race, Orc, for extra weapon and spell damage, max HP and max stamina. Wood Elf or Danmar are probably better. Mundus the Serpent for extra sustain. Lava Food Soup as buff food. 30 points in HP and 34 points in stamina. I'm Vamp stage 3 for undeath, which gives us a little bit more tankiness. And strike from the shadow, extra weapon damage. Potions, like I said before, the normal tricep potions. We don't have to use the brutality potions with venom arrow. CPs, nothing special. Mastered arm, steady aim, do the speed with ironclad. Sustained by suffering, celebrity, pain refuge, and slippery. The PvP combo is easy peasy. Before you start, try to be always in height. Pre buff yourself with relentless focus. Start with Pursing Mark for Major Breach, followed by Venom Arrow to proc the Master's Bow and for Major Brutality, our weapon damage buff, then Lethal Arrow into Magnum Shot into Toxic Barrage. Without Ultimate, use Assassin Scourge or another Lethal Arrow, Magnum Shot as Finisher. Now, with some gameplay footage for you, before the video starts, don't forget to sub my channel, leave a like and a comment below. It really helps, it's for free. And I would really appreciate it. I wish you all a fantastic day. Thanks for watching. And I see you hopefully in the next video. Ciao. Keep us alive
Can't believe.